they just announced a release date for Crunker Season 6. In today's video, we're going to be talking about the Crunker Season 6 release date, all the speculation that got us there, and what to expect from Crunker Season 6. Now, if you guys are excited for this video, make sure you guys leave a like and also subscribe for more Crunker Season 6 content. We're going to be doing openings, gameplays, everything. With that being said, let's just get right into it. So, as I'm sure you guys have seen, there is this M2 drive. I'm really not going to explain it because it's been overdone, but we got this M2 drive with the thoughts that maybe it had some type of leak or information in it. The information we got from this is that Crunker Season 6 was going to come out November 7th, 2022. Seven prongs, 11 dots, 2022. As you guys probably know, it's November 18th. It didn't happen. I think this was just a lot of speculation that just unfortunately didn't work. A lot of people were upset about this not being the Season 6 date, but when you speculate on something and it's wrong, it's pretty hard to be mad at something because you just, like, you assumed something. You It just doesn't make sense. I will say though, I, I, I what is the point of the, the M2 drive, Crunker? If this was not a release date, what is this for? Someone said there's a reason, but I, I genuinely cannot think of it. And then there's also this image that says like forever test something with maybe a BR right here. I don't really know. Again, this is kind of just speculation. It's really there, but we don't know what it means. People are thinking it says 161919 underscore BR. And that's more or less what I see as well. That just doesn't have any significance. So yesterday, November 17th, there was a lot of server issues on Crunker. And typically what happens before a new update comes out is the game goes offline. It gets like disconnected. Update gets released and then the game slowly comes back online. This was what was happening on stream yesterday. Yeah, it does say all New York servers are full, but when I click a, a sum of the a zero out of eights, it says full. And then when I click one that isn't, it disconnects me. And so instantly everyone thought this was Crunker season six. But as you guys can see, well, that ain't good. That ain't good at all. Ladies and gentlemen, I'm not even gonna lie to you. I, I don't think this is good. I think I think their servers are just offline. So what ended up happening was the game was just offline. We were getting disconnected a lot and it kept saying servers are at max capacity. Too many IPs. Everyone legitimately thought this was going to be Crunker season six, but again, it was all on speculation. To be completely fair, this is kind of what happens when updates come out, but just because the game goes offline doesn't mean an update is coming. I think this was just unfortunate timing. And this was actually explained in the Crunker Bunker under game notifications. Noon posted and said, unfortunately, the certificates have expired at a terrible time. Due to time zone issues, no one can renew it and fix it until at least a few hours. Grass is always available outside for the meantime. So more or less what I'm getting from this is they needed to update their servers or like update the certificates to have said servers and it just didn't happen and they couldn't fix it in that time period. As you guys saw at the beginning of this video, the game is back up. So thankfully everything is back to normal. Unfortunately, it just wasn't Crunker season six like a lot of people thought. But but we got some very, very exciting news today. If you go to the official Crunker Twitter page, as you guys can see right on my screen, Crunker Season 6 is coming out November 23rd. Let's go. Leave a lie. We finally have a release date for Crunker Season 6. And as you guys know, I just said it, it's coming November 23rd. This is the first time in Crunker history that we have an official release date for a Crunker Season. Now, there has been release dates for other Crunker seasons. I just don't believe they've ever been met. I could be wrong on this, but I remember in like season two, there being a day to getting pushed back a bunch. And honestly, that happening for a lot of seasons. So that's one thing I'd really like to see continue happening with Crunker now is release dates. Release dates make things so simple. It lets people know when to play the game, when the update will be available. And for someone like me or maybe any other Twitch streamer, we know when to make the content and when to be available to make said content. The one thing I will say is November 23rd is unfortunately vague. Crunker at least throughout its whole life was based in Australia. So someone like me in America, I'd get their updates at two, three, four, five, six, seven in the morning. So at least to me, this is super duper amazing. I'd really like to like have a little bit more on the specific side, but this is an amazing start. Just knowing when it's going to come out, just a 24 hour period is amazing. I am already insanely impressed with what this looks like and we haven't even talked about it yet. I'm insanely impressed that we have a release date. Release dates are huge. And before we just keep talking about it, let's look at this picture and analyze. Same cashy. So we have the picture pulled up in like a, a photo thing. We can look at it. Looking from top to bottom, there's a guy here with a new face, I'm assuming. This vest says KRPD? Unless that just means Crunker to Police Department. I don't know. He is holding some type of FAMAS that kind of looks like it has LEDs going through it or maybe like, I don't know, honestly. Instantly, I'm noticing that there is zeros and ones everywhere. I believe that's binary. This says, use creator code, Sorable. Yeah, there's binary literally everywhere behind this guy. 
guy right here. There's a bunch right here. There's some over here. I'm not sure really what that means. Random thought. We also do have an M2 drive, which I don't particularly see on this screen, but there is binary everywhere and maybe some hints of like robotics here and there. So maybe it's like a computer season. Like I said, that's complete speculation, but that is my literal best guess. Over on the side, we have this skull trooper looking dude with a skull body and a white die. There's not a white die in the game that has black cuffs. I almost wonder if they're just like changing the die system. That's almost what it seems like to me. But there's a little skeleton guy right here, over here with a different face, over here with a different face, over here with a different face. There's some crawling over too. One thing that is weird to me, and maybe I don't understand what's going on yet, it seems like these are a bunch of skeleton zombie looking things trying to get these people, which kind of seems like a Halloween theme. Maybe I'm looking too deep into it. I don't know. One thing I just realized because I'm stupid, this is a six. This whole thing right here is a six. That's why there's a cutout right here. And the little circle thing for the six is right here. So that does look insane, actually. This is a really cool, like, cover poster. Looking at this guy right here, he has a really insane looking head or mask on. He's using some type of the SMG. It looks like the default TBH. He has, like, a robot Tony Stark Iron Man chest. And this says... Igor? 1-G-O-R? Yeah, I have no idea. Moving below that person, we have this person on with the exact same jacket, actually, with a new looking anime type face, and a new looking knife that honestly kind of looks Christmas themed, maybe like a Christmas tree, maybe I'm looking too deep into it. And also, as you guys can see, they are holding two of them. Is this dual wielding knives? Is this a new class? Probably not. We've seen akimbo things in the game before, and typically how they work is you just have, like, one in both hands but you're still just like knifing people you know what i mean moving on over to the left we have these two individuals right here and what is that okay let's just look over here this is the krpd chest again with some sunglasses and it looks like we have like a very simple pistol with a silencer on it but moving over to my boy my dude has the intervention that is legitimately the intervention is it not i mean i guess it's a pretty vague looking sniper but whatever this is it looks very very clean and surely that's not the new class because that looks exactly like a sniper and they are also it's kind of hard to tell but they're wearing the exact same krpd thing as this person with maybe a new face or maybe it's for the picture i don't know and besides that looking around it really seems as if that might just be it yeah unfortunately I feel like this is it. I really do feel like maybe we're, we're missing something in this. One thing I notice is this guy over here seems to have sleeves. And it seems like he has tattered clothing, which is almost insinuating that he is a zombie. But that is interesting. Like I said, it seems like they might be reworking dyes. And it seems like that is just straight up a sleeve right there. Or a weird multicolored dye. I don't know. But yeah, we have a season six release date. And it is coming November 23rd, 2022. And this is like, this is so awesome. Knowing this far ahead, when it's coming out, is a game changer having to stay up night after night after night just seeing if maybe it comes out is is very hard this is amazing thank you crunker and crunker team and forever team and i'm very very excited to see what happens with crunker season six i'm excited to do spins i'm excited to see the new maps new classes everything and i really hope this is a new chapter for crunker but if i missed anything on this picture please let me know in the comments down below i'm actually so excited and that's another thing just giving people the release date it lets so much actual hype build up because that's the thing when, when you let us speculate it's kind of up in the air as we know but this leaves no room for speculation and it just allows for hype and this is amazing and, and i know i just said this but like this literally has me so excited for this new chapter of krunker and i hope you guys are too there's not a ton of information to go off of here but it's coming out pretty soon and i'm gonna have to start wrapping up season five this next week so i hope you guys did enjoy this video and you guys are excited for krunker season six i think that's gonna do it for today's video thank you guys so much for watching this video once again and as always it's been your boy cj or sorable and i'll see you guys in the next one Peace out.